Hey everyone, Dan Sharp here. So I am on the road. I'm heading up north for the dog sled races in Alpena. So excited. It was really iffy if there was going to be enough snow, but it turns out there is. I am now in line at McDonald's. I need some coffee. So I'm going to get some coffee and head up north. I'll see you guys when I get up there. So I made it. The four and a half hour drive was really good. And we had bad roads near the end. I made it to the Thunder Bay Classic Sled Dog Race here in Alpena. So I'm just walking back to the race down that trail. And let's go watch some sled dogs. It's Jessica vlogging me, Yay. and Brittany, Hi. and Greg, and Mike. <laughs> Did you get good pictures down there? Yeah, it wasn't too bad. Yeah. I think so. Thank I didn't you. look through them yet. So you <laughs> Thanks guys! Bye bye! Come on! Day two at Sled Dog Races here at the starting shoot. Just got done helping some teams. Here goes the team on the shoot. Good luck! Hey guys, so I figured I would do some vlogging because I've pretty much just been showing you dogs. Um, so yeah, this is day two at the race here in Alpena. Um, I'll tell you a little bit about the events here um, in the club, this the dog sledding club here, the Mid Union Sled Haulers out of Michigan. They have they're a sprint club, so they do short di short distance races, um, amateur based, all for fun. They have different classes for so they have the three dog class where the adult musher drives three dogs. They have a junior class for kids ages, I think it's 10 to 16. So then kids can take out between two and three dogs. And that's also how it works. It's a mile per dog on average. So the three dog adult class takes three dogs and they go three miles. And then there is a five dog class. They go five miles. A seven dog class, they go roughly seven miles. And then there's also ski jarring, which there were no ski jurors at the race this weekend. And that's where somebody hooks up a, like a belt type thing to their waist and they cross country ski while being pulled by dogs. Um, our club, I think they do normally either one dog or two dog ski jarring. There's a, what we call the kitty pull, 100 yard dash. It's where a little kid, I forget the age range, but they take one dog, 100 yards distance. And then there's also a white pull, which they have a series of weights 
and the dog that can pull the most wins. And it's all based on, I think it's based on their weight and the weight of the original sled that they're pulling. Um, I know you've heard from Jessica's vlogs, but I, I don't know if I've actually told you guys, I used to race side dogs from 2006 to 2011. Um, so I'm really passionate about the sport um, due to some unforeseen events I had to get out of it um, but I would like to get back in it's a lot of fun I love coming to the races helping out seeing my mush family because um, it's a lot of fun great family event um, so yeah I will share um, some links down below if you want to check out the club um, yeah, I'm just heading now to the finish line. I helped my friend Jill get her team out to the start shoot. You saw Jill in last year's video. She told you guys all about why she got into dog sledding and parts of a dog sled and the layout of a dog team. So I'm going to go to the finish line. See you guys in a little bit. Okay, you guys, the races are done for the day. I am all packed up and I'm heading. Make sure I had my hat. Um, I'm heading back downstate. Um, it is really snowy out, and from what I've heard, from what I've heard is that there's freezing rain downstate. So I'm just gonna take my time and I will let you guys know when I got back downstate. So see you guys in a bit. Hey you guys, so I made it back downstate. Um, the roads weren't that bad at all. They were a little iffy out of Alpena County, but after that they were pretty much dry. Had only a little bit of precipitation. So I'm just here editing um, the vlog. And I was putting it all together, I'm like, I'm missing something. And I realized I didn't film the outro. So, just wanted to let you guys know, I made it back in one piece. I'm just sitting here editing the vlog and watching the Grammys. Awesome night. Sled dog video editing and the Grammys. Couldn't get any better than that. Um, so I just wanted to say you guys, thanks for watching this video. Hope you liked it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. I will share the link for the Minute and Sled Haulers down in the description, as well as the last year's video, if you didn't get a chance to watch that. So I will see you guys soon, and remember, stay happy and enjoy life.